hello friends welcome back to our channel so today our topic is subtraction so till now we have learned addition so today we are going to learn subtraction subtraction means nothing but taking away take away okay addition means counting all together so subtraction means taking away okay the symbol of subtraction is minus what is that symbol minus okay so about the concept of subtraction i would like to tell you one short story okay once in a forest there was a naughty monkey and it is very hungry okay finally it got one mango tree see how many mangoes are there 1 2 3 4 5 okay it ate three mangoes it ate three mangoes how many mangoes were left on a mango tree so the monkey ate three mangoes 1 2 3 how many mangoes are left on the tree 1 2 so what is the final answer 2 so this is the concept of subtraction okay subtraction means take away taking away so from five mangoes we are taking away three mangoes so how many are left on a tree one two this is the answer okay so from five mangoes how many man monkey ate one two three so i am striking off three mangoes from five mangoes i am striking off three mangoes so what is the answer two two mangoes are left this is the concept of subtraction so five minus three equals to how many two how many two got it so this is the concept of subtraction subtraction means taking away and the symbol of subtraction is minus what do we call this minus m i n u s okay but that is subtracted is called subtrahan this is called subtrahan s u b t r a h e n d subtrahan okay and the number from which it is subtracted 5 this is called minuend what is this minuend minuend subtrahan and the answer after subtraction that is called the difference what is this difference okay the answer we got after subtraction this is called difference and the number that is subtracted which number we are subtracting 3 we are striking off we are crossing out 3 mangoes so 3 is called subtrahan the number from which it is subtracted 5 this is called minuend the answer we got after subtraction that is called the difference okay this is the concept of subtraction now we will learn the properties of subtraction these are very important children these are the basics for first class students if a number is subtracted from the same number then the difference is zero okay 3 minus 3 equals to 
सो इफ ये नंबर इज सब्ट्रैक्टेड फ्रॉम द सेम नंबर सी बोथ और सेम नंबर सो दिस इज माइनस माइनस मीन्स सब्ट्रैक्शन ओके इफ ये नंबर इज सब्ट्रैक्टेड फ्रॉम द सेम नंबर देन द डिफरेंस इज जीरो थ्री माइनस थ्री जीरो वट डज इट मीन सपोज देर और थ्री बैलून्स और देर थ्री माइनस थ्री मीन्स थ्री यू हैव टू क्रॉस आउट वन टू थ्री हाउ मेनी आर लेफ्ट नथिंग इज लेफ्ट सो जीरो जीरो नथिंग मीन्स जीरो सो फोर माइनस फोर इज ऑल्सो जीरो फाइव माइनस फाइव इज ऑल्सो जीरो सो वॉट डज इट मीन फ नंबर इज सब्ट्रैक्टेड फ्रॉम द सेम नंबर then the difference is zero okay 10 minus 10 is nothing but zero only so what is the second one if zero is subtracted from the given number then the difference will be the given number only so when zero is subtracted from the given number what will be the difference it will be the given number only 3 only will be the answer okay so here 3 apples are there 3 minus 0 minus 0 means nothing we have to cross out so leave it like that so how many are left 1 2 3 only okay this is the meaning of this property so 4 minus 9 minus 0 Nine only. Okay, so these are the basic properties of subtraction, children. So you have to remember these two for the further classes also. Now these are the small examples of vertical subtraction. Okay, see how to do nine minus four. you can open your fingers and close this number of fingers or otherwise you can draw pictures and cross out the number of things okay so 9 is there here so i am drawing 9 sticks 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 minus 4 means 4 you have to cross out 1 2 3 Four. How many are left? One, two, three, four, five. So five is the answer. So this is the way we have to do vertical subtraction. Here first six are there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Minus two means two. You have to cross out. One, two. So how many are left? One, two, three, four. In the same way, we have to draw eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Minus five means five. You have to cross out one, two, three, four, five. How many are left? One, two, three. Now we see this. How many? One, two, three. Minus three means three. We have to cross out one, two, three. How many are left? Nothing is left. Means zero. So this is the property of subtraction. So if a number is subtracted from the same number, the difference will be zero only. Okay. So see you in the next video. Until then, practice more and more examples like this. Okay, then you will be perfect children. Okay, so until then, take care. Bye bye. Enjoy the joy of learning.